A pair of bridges along a major highway in Kalamazoo will join the growing list of construction projects in our area. News 8's David Horak breaks down the issues it's addressing and the timeline. We're talking about bridges that are more than, more than a half century old and probably had a 25 to 30 year design life. So we're well past that. The bridges in question tower over KL Avenue and is a part of US 131 between the Main Street and Stadium Drive exits. MDOT spokesman Nick Sharippa says technological improvements allow crews and inspectors to extend the bridge's lifespan and usability but they are now really showing their age. If we were putting uh, a calendar together with the pictures of our best bridges, that's not going to make March, right? That's, that's not going to be one of our greatest. But uh, it's not a threat. It's not in danger. We've been patching patches of patches that we patched five years ago for years. And it's not new. People who have driven over that know that. Beginning mid-2023, crews will begin demolishing and replacing the bridges. Before then, a planned yet temporary third bridge will be built to help continue two-lane traffic in each direction. So if we shut down northbound to rebuild that bridge, we'll use that temporary bridge for northbound traffic, or that third bridge for northbound traffic, and then vice versa for southbound traffic when we're rebuilding the southbound bridge. Below, KL will be shut down presumably from 11th to Concord Place Drive, with likely detours to be Main and Stadium, but those will be finalized by Kalamazoo County. Another hurdle for crews is that MDOT owns the bridges, but the property below where the tracks are at is owned by Amtrak, which could be a logistical nightmare with passenger trains passing through every day. That's not something we really want to mess with, and not just a schedule-wise, but that's a liability. Certainly, we want to make sure that we're doing our part right. Amtrak wants to make sure that they're doing their part right. We all kind of want to make sure we're moving in the right direction at the same time. An Amtrak spokesman says they do not comment on projects, but did confirm to News 8 this one is set to move forward on their end. Once the contractors are assigned and work starts next year, the project is expected to be finished by spring 2025. We're in Kalamazoo, David Horak, News 8.